much to do, so much to exhaust. Hi. Oh, hi. Would you guys like anything else? Um, I'd like a little more coffee, and you can just take this. Nothing. Thank you. I am so glad you liked it because the script is perfect. It's, you know, a young man with, you know, leukemia and he's dying and there's no one. Yes, honey, I've read the script. Your script is fabulous. I'm sorry. I just don't have time. I've got too many other projects in pre-production. I just don't have the time for it. I'm sorry. Where is the waitress? I'm running late. I'm having a pedicure. Wait a minute. I've got an idea. I know a man, call him, Rand Brenner. He can help you. I'm sure he'll love it. Bye-bye now. Thanks. I can do this. I am powerful. I am in control. I want the money. Is there anyone else I can talk to? Oh, God. you know, I just, I just need a little. Please, oh, can't you? So what you're telling me is that the light has gone out on this whole project. No, I'm, I'm sorry. It's, it's not you, it's me. Okay. I will. Thanks. Bye. Amy, no one is working this weekend. Stay home with me, please. I can do this, okay? I have to do this. I made you a promise to do this, make this movie before... This is insane. I haven't seen you in so long. We need the money. We have the money. Slow down. Stay with me. Oh, this is fine coming from a guy who I didn't see for five years. Yeah, and because of it, I didn't get a chance to be with mom and dad before they died. Here. Bye. are his secretary, right? You have no idea how hard it's been to find Rand Brenner. Well, what do you mean he's taking time off? Well, when's he gonna be back? Oh, I... Yeah, okay. I'm sorry. Sure. Okay, thanks. Honey, I know that we've never met since you moved in with your brother. Hi, my name is Tara. I live right next door. Hi. And I see you coming and going at all hours. This must be hard on you, what with your brother's illness and all. Yeah, it is. You know, honestly, I, I don't know what to do anymore. Can I do anything for you too? No. No one can help me, but thank you. Thank you very much. There is someone that can help. And he will, just as soon as you ask. Honey, have you asked God yet? I need help now, not like next year. And I, I don't think God can help me with my problem. Let go. Let God solve the problem. So you can take care of Mac. He needs you now. He needs you now. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mac. Happy birthday to you. And many more. Thank you, everyone. My birthday.
birthday and Christmas in the same week. Wow. Huh? Thanks for saving us the money, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> make a wish, make a wish, make a wish, wish, make a wish. Okay. If I could have just gotten Taran Brenner. Oh, with the big shot. I don't know, I just, this whole thing, I surrender it. Cause you know what? I asked last night for a sign from God and I'm gonna wait for it. You know, I mean, I did everything right. I made all the right phone calls. I went to every meeting and nothing, nothing. So I'm just gonna sit here and wait. Oh, oh hey, look, look. Good morning. Good morning. I was saying that you're having your coffee and I'm having my coffee too, so could we talk for just a few minutes? Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> I just want to invite you to this luncheon given later today for people with your illness. It is hosted by another new and very dear friend of mine. Come on, it will be fun. It'll be really inspiring to have someone like you there. Oh, there you are. Hi, how are you? Yes, I guess. And he's got a cure for And they can fix it up. They can heal it. How's it going, Chief? Good to see you. Oh, my gosh. I am so ready, Ann. Good to see you. Good to see you. I'm glad you could make it. Glad you could make it. Thanks, thanks. Good to see you, too. Well, it'll... This is Mac and his sister Amy. Rand Brenner. 